so actually one of the most customizable custom rooms which was based on android 11 12 12.1 is now back with android 13 yes we're talking about cr droid and if you don't know and if you actually didn't use cr droid yet this was or maybe right now is one of the most customizable custom rooms it includes a lot of customizations yes android 13 things are actually quite different especially with this initial build but right now this is still one of the most customizable custom rooms i'll talk about some of the new things and my first impressions about this first of uh, first initial build based on android 13 right now it's available for only few of the devices or maybe as unofficial version or maybe it's coming official very very soon let's have a quick look on these things first of all the quick settings panel it was kind of expected that you will see the dark quick settings background and this is what we have the dark quick settings background even in the light mode so for me yes i don't like this much but yes it's just user's own preference one thing let me show you if I move on to these extra tiles options, we did not got any major changes so far. Yes, it is initial build, but still no major changes, nothing new. So yes, let's see what they what they will do with the next update. But one thing which I liked a lot about this one with this update is the launcher. The launcher is not pixel launcher. The launcher which you have is of course the Android zone launcher, which includes the icon pack support first of all. If you want to use any third party icon pack you can it's very easy a lot of free icon pack options are available on google play store you can download any one of those including that icon size which you can customize the option is quite useful for some of the users if you always use like i sometimes use icon size to 95 percent but if you don't want to customize that it's up to you we also have some of the customizations related to home screen too which means we have some status bar customizations we have a hot seat background which is available even in custom maybe it was available with corvus os also we also have double tap to sleep some basic customizations here and there one more thing let me show you if i move on to the app drawer you have the option to disable the icon labels yes which will give you a very good look with the app drawer recents actually does not have anything so yes it's not completed yet yes we'll see a lot of new changes in the upcoming update but this is the first initial update what we have in miscellaneous you have the hide apps option you have the protected apps option protected apps basically means app lock a lot of users need this thing and it's already included even with the initial build so that's actually good although it's just available with the default launcher so we may expect these things if i move on to the app drawer if you're able to notice the icon bag which is by default included is the same one which you have in lineage os like lineage os 19 also introduced this kind of icon bag and as far as i know while making this video lineage os 20 is already there actually i haven't got hands on with that but maybe i'll take a look at that and will share my experience very soon if i move on to the settings option you can see settings ui does not have any major changes it's almost same nothing unique as expected but yes cr droid settings are there which was quite a good thing a main highlight about this one but if something is included unfortunately not as you can see cr droid does not have any customization not a single customization which is of course kind of weird but yes it's still okay the source may be work in progress but yes we still have some of the customizations related to status bar etc and yes if you're still looking for it don't worry i will talk about all those things later on in this video so stay tuned make sure to watch this video till the end if i move on things as you can see they only have the about cr droid share supporters github community etc etc you can go and check it out you can go and explore these things if you want to and yes the customization which i was talking about available in system settings you can see we have buttons which means where you can enable the advanced restart option which is a very useful feature like if you're using a custom room you definitely need these things you have the option for that including that you can see control playback which is also quite useful show volume panel on left if you want to enable this thing or not it's up to you but these things are actually quite good this custom room this cr droids first initial build only have some of the useful features but not major changes one more thing which i found here in cr dot this this version is that they just included some of the features like which were available in the lineage os also i think so these things were present in the lineage os too like in status bar customizations we have the option for clock settings for example you can enable the show seconds option battery percentage options available there 
auto brightness icon if you want to enable or disable it's up to you and same like that some of the icon customizations related to system icons and yes this is also quite useful one more thing which i found here is this system icons customization the thing is if you're able to notice the ui is bit changed it's not actually looking like android 12 or android 13 but yes it's okay as i just mentioned the source may be work in progress but let's see gestures actually does not have any kind of thing at least swipe to screenshot shall be there but let's see in this first build this is not there too and yes that is why i will not provide the link in the description for anything because this is the normally uh, unofficial version which i'm using right now on redmi note 8 so i don't think so it makes sense of using this thing we have many other good options available for example evolution xos is one of the one of the best you definitely need to check it out if you want to if you're looking for android 13 based custom that room is quite good including that project zephyrus is a good choice for you too as you can see if i move on to the security settings i even does not have the fingerprint unlock and etc that is just because of the unofficial versions what i'm using right now as i just mentioned as i'm using unofficial version on redmi note 8 these things might be different in your case in official version for sure and that is why the official version is not there but some of the source changes which we found in the first initial version i just shared with you my experience you can see wallpaper and style has all the android 13 features so that's good which was expected and here's some of the things like the default launcher you just saw we have the features and that thing might be available in the official version too so this is not something like you can say that clickbait it's not like that it's actually an official version based on android 13 this is pure android 13 and let's see what they will give you what they will provide you with the android 13 initial official version and that might be based on beta that might be considered as beta i think so one more thing which i liked about this version is this pure black you have the pitch black version and for me i sometimes use this thing even if you're able to notice my screen guard right now which i applied on redmi note 8 is actually good this is ceramic black and with the help of this pitch black theme this is looking super good you are you are able to notice this in video too Vibration and haptics also have same kind of menus available. You have the option for always true icon in sound and vibration, etc. etc. These are things which you have available. Other than else, things are basically same like other custom rooms, no major changes. These are things where I just want to let you know. I hope you like this thing. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, don't forget to like and share this. Also, if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe the channel. I have a lot of Android 13 based custom home videos available already. You can check out my videos. Around 1000 plus videos are already available on our channel. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.